He's feeling it! Dude, he's ready! Dude! Yo, dude, Alien, get on this. So, Shiny <laughs> Monkey 8 is being Lucario, and, uh... So, Ben is rocking the Carissa tag as Carissa the Villager. With, like, the super baked villager. Dude, that's my favorite with one. With eyeshadow. My favorite's the pink one in the dress. That looks sick. Dude, this guy looks so high. <laughs> <laughs> this is a family establishment, Alien. Okay. This guy looks so tired from lack of sleep. So the thing with Lucario is the aura effect is like kind of ridiculous in this game. I've heard that if you're like 180, things kill at... Force Smash kills at 30%. That's hype, dude. <laughs> dude, no, it's jank. <laughs> I know, the jank is good. Dude, I love... I love Villager. Villager kind of like is like a... He's got like these cute little things, but... This is actually disturbing. Like, w looking at the villager's face and how his expression never changes. Dude, it's just... <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, it changed right there. I guess it changes when he gets hit. But as he's, like, slowly killing you with strange items. I... I don't know if, like, Jam and Toast will do this, but I really dig... When I'm playing villager, I, like, try to keep... I do a lot of slingshot, because I'm a dirty Falco main. And I just, like, kind of get them with that off stage or something. Oh, yeah. He's just dropping bowling balls. Yeah. Oh, my lord. That's... That covers most of the platform, doesn't it? Yeah, it looked like it. Oh this my god, he made a tree. Oh my god. Dude. I think Jamentos picked Villager so he could take the Aura Spheres that would kill him. Yeah, well... Do we'll you think so? I think oh, so. Oh, jeez, that was a sick recovery. I don't know if it was easy or not, but it looks hard. I usually go for a tree there because it's a bigger hitbox, but sometimes you don't have the time to set it up. Great use of slingshot from Jam and Toast, just zoning him out with projectiles. How many projectiles does Villager have? Dude. I think his dash attack is considered projectile. Like, oh when yeah. you throw the pot at them. Yeah. You can, like, throw, you can do that off stage and hit them with it. Dang. The bowling ball is kind of a projectile. Oh! Oh, well, he survived. Dude, you should totally pocket that. Did you see that, like, video of, like, uh, Vill Mutant King, like, pocketing, uh, trees, like, playing hot potato with them? No. In Villager Dittos? Is it insta kill? Because it, like, oh. doubles the damage of Bowling Ball and Tree. Dang. So if you pocket Bowling Ball and Tree, it's just... Oh, dude, I think he wanted it. Oh. Oh, oh no! Oh! The pop! Got him! Dude, that's <laughs> so hard to hit. You have to space it so the dare... You have to space it so that it doesn't hit his body, so he can't do another one. Oh. Dang, that was hype. Yeah, I dude. didn't even know it was hype, and it was hype. Right, Dude, I'm actually like not really used to seeing like really high level Smash 4. But they're doing like a pretty good job. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, let's get this going. <laughs> it's Dude, you mean let's get this going? Oh, dude, that is pretty good actually. I th was that the 2 turn up or the 3? I didn't 3 see. spikes, I think. See, it, it, it's probably clear that I know nothing about this game. I didn't even know there were multiple turn ups. Or numbers. Turn up numbers. Well, like one does like three spikes. Well, meteors, I guess. Is it random? Yeah, I think so. Jank. Oh, we got him with the. Oh my god. It will be, dude. Did he pocket it? I think he did. I would be scared right now. Oh, nice read. So I didn't know you could run past the tree. Uh, yeah. You the tree. Oh, that was a. Damn. Great read. read. I think where wasn't Jamatos one of like the like uh, on the Washington Brawl PR when it was a thing? Uh, pro uh, probably. So, well, I thought Chip was one of the best Brawl players too, if I recall. Did Shiny ever play Brawl? Do you know? Yes, he did. He played Fox though. I feel like it's hard to. I feel like Smash 4 neutral game is really hard because God. nothing's. Dude, he's reads. I know. Nothing is safe on shield, you know? Like, well, very few things in the game. Like, only spaced aerials are safe on shield. Yeah. So you're somewhat at a disadvantage when attacking, but once you get the read, you can convert off of it pretty hard, actually. So, neutral's kind of. I feel like I'm not that interested in, like, the neutral Smash 4, but the punish game is, like, pretty interesting to me. Oh, least. yeah. I just like seeing reads. <laughs> it's cool. So it's the Falcon player. Yeah, dude. Three, two, one, 
Oh, no, he switches to Rob, interesting, and goes to Battlefield. The only thing, a the first thing Alien said to me about Smash 4 is, can we moonwalk? Yeah, <laughs> that was the most important part. And I knew you couldn't, but Dude, I wanted to believe. When I, uh, when I, when Crustin and I first started playing Smash 4, first thing he, ch he tells me, he, the first thing he messages me is, dude, you can shield drop in this game. It's so easy. <laughs> oh, dang. That's kind of hype. I haven't that's seen very many. That's all he cares about. Shield, shield dropping is really sick. In Melee, at least. I don't know about this game. I think it's, like, useful because... Yeah, it's useful in every game. There I, was I don't think you can, like, pr pressure, like platforms as easily as you can in melee you know yeah you know how easy shield dropping was in smash 64 dude there's no like <laughs> you know there's no spot dodge so yeah i love smash 64 yeah, jamatos needs to kill this guy as soon as possible and it's probably not going to happen with this like reco with oh. recovery oh man he made it back all right oh that covers that kill the entire oh. air dodge that's a kill box yeah, dude, he, he looks like he's just like trying to like he's toss a salad or like yeah. dancing, <laughs> Make, mixing up some some dude, batter. Oh, oh got Stay him. Spike, let's go! <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Smash Four, <laughs> where where stage spikes are awesome. Actually, they were awesome in every game, basically. Especially, oh! especially the one Sh uh, Chevy tried to get got on you. <laughs> were you? Oh yeah, the tech. <laughs> he's just like fuck. <laughs> Alright. Zoning him really well with the like the top right there. Did Jantos play uh Did he play Robin Brawl? It switched to who? Snake. I think that was good DI. Sell out. Wait, can you there's no DI in this game, huh? There is DI. It there got is. switched. So the is the thing is they had like vectoring, which like makes actual intuitive sense. It does. DI it, it like it, it, Pull the direction you want to go in, you know, that makes Maybe sense. it's like Smash DI, basically. Yeah, but like, ve vectoring makes sense. Like, DI, like, the perpendicular part isn't, like, intuitive to new players, I don't think. So I got used to, like, vectoring to live in Smash 4. Then they patched it, and I was, and I was like, dying in melee because of vectoring. So now I die in both games, because I suck. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Yeah. All right, so Jammin takes game two. Yeah, I think Vill I think he's much more comfortable with Rob than Villager. Yeah, I think Villager's like a secondary jank counterpick character. Rob has like surprisingly good kill moves on most of his aerials. I was surprised. Yeah, that that up air is ridiculously good. That Nair is like pretty good to approach with. Like he's just short hopping over the projectiles and just going with the Nair. Yeah. Wait, uh, where do you think Shine's gonna take him? I don't know the counterpicks that well, but I Congo Jungle, uh, Castle Siege, Halberd. I think. I don't think. Yoshi's pipes. No, I'm just joking. I don't know. 75M. I'm thinking one of the like either. I'm thinking. Take him to 75M. Uh, I think du Duck Hunt. Yeah, Duck Hunt is Beca a counter pick. Because like I think the birds pro block projectiles if you hit them, so it's less. It, like if characters with strong projectile games are kind of hindered by Duck Hunt. <laughs> yeah, that that does make sense. I don't think an FD like stage benefits either of these players that much, so. The wall. Warrior where FD has the walls. Yeah. Oh, Lucario can wall jump. You're right. Lucario's like the longest wall cling in the game, doesn't he? Or is it him or Sheik? I don't know. Dude, this menu music is epic. <laughs> Just the melee one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude, I love melee. <laughs> Me too. Alright. Takes him to Smashville. Is this, a, this is a 2 out of 3 set, correct? Yeah, I think the uh, thing is Lucart. I don't, I'm not sure why Shiny took him here. <laughs> I love the flip. That's uh, so good. Holy it covers God. so much space. Well, it's just out there for a long time, so it covers the air dodge, which is really cool. Yeah. I think that. I don't know why you would like uh, Shiny would take him to this stage because like the FD likes thing doesn't really benefit him, and yeah. the ledge recovery benefits uh, Jamatos more than he him. Or maybe he can go out further to kill using yeah. the fl platform there. Okay, that down smash is pretty strong too. He got the balloon. He won already. <laughs> GG. Oh no, he went too no deep. No re. What is happening? Okay. Dude, edge fights. Like it's you can pretty like liberally go off stage if you're like if you just want to kill them with like a stage spike or something. Oh my God, the laser beam. Covering that so recovery many options. Is huge. Jamatos told me he doesn't. Even, this is the only game he plays right now. Really? Oh, he won twice, dude. The set's over. GG. 3-0. 3-0. <laughs>
Luke. Wait, you, you didn't give Jam, Jam and Toast his game win. Hey, come on, man. Be accurate. Okay, he's going deep. Super deep. Oh. Whoa. Like it's so the thing with like Lucario's aura, if you didn't know, is that the the bigger like the more damage Lucario is, the not only does like the length of his attacks start like the length the like range and power of his attacks increase, but also the like size of his recovery. It's actually very common to be off stage, overshoot the recovery, and just die like on the other side. <laughs> That's actually like, kind of funny. <laughs> it's kind of just silly. Oh, the air dodge. Oh no. Can we got him with the flail, tossing the salad. Dude, it's great. <laughs> oh, I feel like it's uh, that top item is really good for like pressuring, covering options. Yeah. Oh, and laser beams. Oh no. Oh, good weight and shield grab. This good, is good balloon. I'm not quite sure if Jamitos does this, but I feel like I've heard Ooh. that Z dropping it to, would do, like do a bunch of times do a lot of damage. Would probably be pretty useful. What is Z dropping? It's like you know how Peach can uh. Like, drop the turn up if she's falling. It's just with Z. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jamitos takes it. So, if, if Peach drops a turn up while she's, uh, while she's falling, it'll, like, you know, bounce off the person. That's how, like, get, that's how you do home run contests, right? You just keep dropping a turn up on them. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. you keep dropping the bat on it, right? Uh, I, I see Mega Man player Z drop the Metal Blade. I'm not quite sure if Jam and Toast would Z drop, continuously Z drop the top if that does anything. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I bet it would, but it might be hard to set up. Is this best of five, do you know? Okay, is our only finals best of five? Yeah. Alright, perfect. So who's still in the... Do we have a bracket? So I... So DeFoot's still in, Xerxion's still in. I gotta wait. We gotta wait till one of these people uh, get knocked. One of the people who live in the past get knocked out so we can head over. <laughs>